hello welcome back to my channel today is another day i'm in london i'm creating content i came to get a visa and at the same time i'm showing you guys this beautiful place so just do me a little favor though please do subscribe so where are we we are in Putney. i don't know if you know about Putney. i'll put it on the video i came here to do to get a document because i'm traveling so i need to make sure all the visas and everything is ready i think i need to tell you guys what happened because i went to the embassy they're telling me the documents provided is not enough even though they state on your website that you need to provide sufficient fund you know and i did provide that but yet still they still want me to go to the bank print the statement and get the bank to stamp it so now i'm at the bus station and show you guys around the bit and then i'll get the bus then i'll get to the station and then we can uh, continue uh, vlogging from there so i came to london today to apply for german visa because visa metro is no longer processing their visas uh, they gave the contract to tls contacts i'll put it on the description the process is tedious you know i have to travel about two miles to get a statement printed all right so at the moment we i'm um, just on the double decker bus uh, we're heading to uh, we're on the putney high street at the moment yes So I just want to show you guys how the the London uh, double deck high bus look like. Thirty-seven, two. And if you can see, I'm the only one on the deck, and nobody's down here, which is pretty amazing. Oh my God, that's very bumpy. Beautiful, right? It's beautiful. It's pretty amazing. So I came to London and I came to do some document, but. I just thought I'd show you guys how beautiful uh, London looks like today. Um, I want to get there and get the stuff sorted so that we can uh, do some content. The weather is scorching today and I don't know, um, I'm so stressed because I have to be on the bus twice now to get this document printed just because I need a visa. You know, I've provided all the documents required. I've even tried to email it to them, but they still said uh, they can't see the balance. Even though my online banking showed the balance, they still want the paper copy, you know, we're in a modern world, we use technology. It's, it's tedious. You know, previously, the German embassy contacted me to provide a document, which was easy. I don't have to travel to the embassy to provide a document. But today, the contractors are telling me I need to go to the bank and get it printed, which is awful. Which is awful. Right. We are currently in a, a Portney, uh, that's where we're heading towards to Glifton Road and I will show you guys how um, or where two, to submit seven. the visa for Germany, Switzerland, France. It's quite a beautiful place actually, you know, the process is amazing apart from the service. You know, the process is easy, but the service, because the information you get on the website is totally different when you get here. And I have to do a vlog purely on this process because people are getting stressed in there. But you know, I managed to uh, get to the bank and use uh, Apple Mac, you know, 
directly out on the horse. Then the driver was very nice and said, get off here, and then the bike is just next on your right. Yeah, so guys, let me flip the camera so I can show you Putney, and then we can uh, continue vlogging. So if you are in London, there's a bus number 220 from from Hammersmith. Uh, you can use that bus to get to Putney. And also there's a bus number, I believe it is 337-170 and 37. You can also get here, um, you can also get to the embassy using these buses. Um, I'll show you guys at the bus stop and then if you're coming to London, but you want to use the bus, probably take some pictures of London. This will be the perfect place. Right. I think the bus just stands, so I need to get off the bus and then find my way to uh, the embassy, right? So I just got off the bus now, I'm heading to uh, the embassy, the embassy is just in front of me there. But to get there, I need to cross the road and then use the other routes and then probably get there. Um, let me just find the camera to take you over the bridge, then I can show you the other part of the, the building, okay? So I'm heading to the embassy now. Obviously, I'm not allowed to film in there, but I will show you guys how outside look like. And then I'll turn the camera off. And then when I'm out, then we can continue vlogging. And then I will stop over somewhere and show you guys uh, the process. It's, it's very stressful. It shouldn't be, but you know, if that's how they want it, you know, people made their own rules, even though the documents or the information on the website says that you need this, 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 this. When you provide it, you get to the embassy or you get to the contest center, they say, no, it's not like that. So this is where the, the, the embassy is, is here. This building here is located in the RAM, the RAM quarter. That's where the contact center is. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to uh, walk around and then show you guys the other parts of the building. Then we walk in and then we can uh, continue vlogging from there. Right, so I'm heading to the embassy now. Uh, the building is just in front of me here. Uh, I don't know if uh, cameras are allowing the premises, but you know, I always do turn the cameras off sometimes, you know, just because I don't want to be in trouble. Right, so I'm just heading there now. Uh, this is where the building is. So now let's walk in. It's quite a beautiful place, right? Beautiful. It's an amazing place. So I'm just uh, going to walk in now. Uh, I don't have to reserve appointment now because I've already started the process. So what I'm going to do is hand over the documents, pay, and then wait for the embassy to send me my passport back. Right, so let's get in. So this was amazing. I finished the process. I will tell you guys because you know sometimes I think we get it confused 
so you just have to follow the process uh, this lady at the embassy melissa one of them you know she was doing her job so she gave me all the required documents you know i went to the bank and i was lucky to get uh, a five pound notes which is not a legal tender but you know this will be in the lounge somewhere you know i'll hang it on the wall but thanks to melissa i came here i finished the process so i just have to come back to the uh, the same location and pick the passport so this is how this place look like the embassy let me flip the camera so that i can see uh, how the tls contact center look like So I have finished the process now, um, I don't know how long it's going to take but normally German embassies are quite seamless, it should take about 6 days and then once I get the visa I just have to fetch it up, check to make sure uh, the details are correct and once they're correct it's pretty easy, travelling to Germany creating content for you guys. So like I told you guys Germany is on the list of uh, this year's trip so yeah this is the embassy, uh, this is the content centre, this is the business that process all the visas for Switzerland, France, Germany. So this is how it looked like. Beautiful place, right? So once you come here, all you have to do is you go straight in there, check your document and check security. Once you pass, you walk in. Simple as that. Right. Let's uh, go get the bus and then start uh, the main uh, journey. Right, so I'm heading to Oxford Street or, or North London somewhere. So the place is located in Putney. Yeah, is it Putney? I think Wandsworth. I'll put it in the, yeah, I'll put the address in the description. I don't know, I can't pronounce the word. It's Wormsworth. Wormsworth. Yeah, is that the right word? I'm not pronouncing it. Uh, I think I have some speech problem today. It's Wormsworth. Wormsworth. That's where the place is. So let me just flip the camera to show you guys how beautiful this bridge looks like. Amazing, right? Beautiful. That's the building right there. And then here, once you finish the visa process, you can sit here and have a nice coffee. I believe a lot of people sit here and have a coffee, probably just enjoy the beautiful view of uh, Wormsworth. <laughs> Am I pronouncing it right, guys? Let's continue the vlog. All right, let's continue now. All right. All right, so now I'm heading to the train station or the bus stop to get a bus to, uh, to the other part of London. I don't know where yet, but you know, whatever this uh, GoPro, and land me that's where you'll be seeing us right so let's uh let's find a bus stop or the train station and I head to the central london hi <laughs> Hey, I'm doing a video for a YouTube channel called Ghana Fan Tube. How are you guys doing today? Yeah, What's your name? Sarai. And you? My name is Matt. 